But that's the lies of the bunch of family, man. The most like gonna destroy the all that, man. He's gonna he's gonna raise up the leg and the one third, man. He's gonna destroy this place, man. This shit gonna be dust, man. This is First Timothy chapter four, chapter four, verse one. Now the Spirit speaketh expressively that in the latter times some shall depart from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. Man, y'all so-called Christians, man, that ain't in your damn churches, man. Y'all got so much flake crapping up your hands. You talking about, oh, I'm shaking the, um, my ass for the Lord, man. Man, death to you, man. Because yeah, if y'all got so much faith, and when, them, when shit get real, when martial law get real, man, that shit kick in. When that chip kick in, man, y'all gonna be the same one talking about, oh, who, who you who, um, who you for, man? Y'all not, not gonna call them the Lord's name now. Y'all gonna be fearing, man, like little hoes, man. Especially y'all males, man, hiding behind y'all females, like little bitches, man. When shit get real, y'all gonna depart from the faith, man. Y'all not gonna even call the name the Lord. Y'all probably gonna even hide y'all damn Bible, man. Y'all gonna be so, y'all face so weak, y'all gonna even take the trip with no hesitation, man. They're gonna run up in your damn crib tell my oh, take this shit right now, man. Y'all gonna take it, man. Fucking, boy, I'm about to say something. That goes for the people, some of the brothers that's in the truth right now, too. It's gonna get to a point in time where they're gonna be so hungry, some of them gonna, gonna give in to that shit and take what they do. They're gonna see their kids crying and they're gonna be like, damn, I need to get that shit so I can feed my kid. That, that also, that's what they're talking about, also, too. Cunt. Did you say something? Go ahead. Just like. Yeah, like you said, like a brother, so it's, it's not even like in, in time when the chip is like implemented and stuff, and some brothers already departed from the faith, man. Like that nigga Rance Noble committed adultery with his brother, man. That's 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 ultimately departing from the faith, man, because as soon as you commit adultery, you should know you're going to surely get put to death. That's man. right. You're a fucking reprobate, man. That's it. You got to... That, man, that's your, that's your um, spiritual brother, man. How the hell you gonna be sleeping with your spiritual brother? Especially if we're in the same camp, man. One of these boys that got a, um, a wife, man, we just gonna, like, greet her and say what's up for the first time. And we ain't gonna have no conversation with her, man. Well, that's that's his probably right there, man. Mm -hmm. yeah, man. This, is, this is John chapter 10, verse 12. But he that is in a hireling and not the shepherd whose own whose own the sheep are not seeth the wolf coming and leaveth the sheep and flee it that's that's a false prophet today man the um joe osteen mr white man now over there preaching the word man and to these fake they can they, they just fag it man anytime you see this faggot on tv this nigga always got the perfect ass smile his white ass teeth man these the same people not teaching our people who who really are according to the scriptures, man. Not teaching the real name, man. They don't they don't even know how to break down the scripture correctly, man. So what they'll do, they'll probably read like one sentence, and then you got the piano man stop playing the beat, and he start dancing around the damn church, man. What the hell you doing dancing, man? You're supposed to be preaching the word, man. They all gonna run away from the um the truth, man. I seen nobody growing up in the church challenge the pastor like damn pastor, you going off, man. Who who gonna have the guts to challenge the pastor, man? Nobody, because everybody calls in there, man. They got so much respect for Pastor Portrop, man, with every word he got to say, man. But what the hell he did for you, man? He did nothing, man. Oh, he built up a church. He threw your birthday party. Oh, man, he, he's, the man, he, man, he's the man of the Lord, man. Can I say so? They don't challenge a pastor because, first of all, them motherfuckers in the church, they ain't got no knowledge, man. You you can only challenge some, somebody if you know something. Come. They don't know shit, man. They go to church. These pastors don't teach them shit. These pastors are just motivational speakers, man. That's all these pastors is, man. You're gonna get a big house if you're tired. You, you're gonna prosper. The Lord never said that, man. That's right. And one more thing. Go, go, go to what the brother was saying earlier, man. Niggas like TD Jakes, all these motherfuckers. But then you got, you got niggas in, in Israel, man. Like Harlem Shake Nate, Sabah, God. Bubble Eyes, Comfy. Gahena, Comfy. These niggas Comfy. sold up, man. That 14th Street faggot. These niggas sold out, man. The only, only brothers, the only men that's pushing out the truth is the scene, man. It's the, it's the elders of GMS, man. That's it. That's all I gotta say, man. This is John chapter 10, verse 12. But he that is in hireling, and not the shepherd, whose own the sheep are not, 
seeth the wolf coming, and leaveth the sheep, and fleeth. And the wolf catcheth them, and scattereth the sheep. The hireling fleeth, but he is an hireling, and careth not for the sheep. That's right, man. This, this is sheep right here, man. These damn pastors, man, they don't, they don't give, they don't care about you, man. They don't give two shits about you, man. So all it is, it's just an act, man. They only, they only care about their money. They damn hummer they're about to get. Brand new, the next year that came out. They only care about their damn three houses they got, man. Yeah, man. So what they do, they have probably often like three or four times, man. Talking about, oh, we building a new building for the kids. Though. They're trying to make it seem innocent now, now. You're bringing the kids, man. No. We bring in some type of new daycare center for the kids, and they pull out the collection plate in the front of the pulpit, and then they play the damn music. There it is. They they playing you in by that music, man. That damn devil music, man. They about to start dancing, shaking that damn booty, so, so called for the Lord, making it rain ones, tens, five, man. It's a lot. Not to cut you off. Back when I was in the world, you feel me? I remember one time I went to church with my mom, and then they was having a, another pastor from this different church visit dog came in the bitch like all right man for the lord for the lord i don't want nobody under a hundred dollars what hundred dollars or you not for the lord i'm like what the fuck how the fuck you gonna tell me how much i gotta put in this shit for the lord bruh then dog started lowering his price like fifty dollars for the lord you got fifty dollars don't come up like yo you know Jake don't got no damn businesses, man. We got nothing but Washington in our pockets, man. Now, what you mean? Some two-third duck signed off his whole paycheck that night, dog. Hey, what's say? What's say? Buy, buy the truth and sell it, doc, man. So you get the truth, you come out, and you show it to your to your brothers, man. You show it to your peoples, man. You you don't you don't get the truth and go sell it like a fucking monkey ass coon, man. You get a gift, man, you share that, man. That's right. How about Shim Yah Shah bless you with a gift, man, you share that, man. That's right. You don't sell it, man. That's right. Because when Yah was trying to preach the word, he ain't, he ain't preached me for like 30 minutes. Yeah. It's all juicy. You engaged, man. And he, he cuts you short. I like, all right, for the rest of y'all guys, there is life, man. Y'all got to pay a fee now, man. So y'all want to listen to the rest, man. Nah, it wasn't like that, man. The truth is Yeah, man, the two poor people for free, man. Because it's funny as hell. You always have like a guest at your damn churches. That's why the most high does not dwell in churches, man. There's nothing but wickedness going on in there, man. You have like a guest singer that can come in there, and he'll probably be singing, introduce his name, whatever. And as soon as he's done, y'all supposed to be selling knowledge anyway. Even the pastor will tell him, we're not going to sell the CD. But after he's done, he'll make a quick announcement. Oh, see for $9.99, but you can meet me in the back of the church at the service when it's done, man. Yeah. They always, I don't care if it's, he's damn, um... If it's gospel or Christian rap, because you got Christian rappers probably years back, they were saying like Christian rap gonna be the, the next hottest thing. And yeah, I don't believe it now, we just came out. But look at today, man. Christian rap, they came up, man. But these niggas and these damn songs, because I um, I listen to these damn songs, man. Especially on 116, one, one of the most popular ones. I'm going that way, you tripping. <laughs> but Craig, these damn niggas, man, they sweet talking, man. This nigga got good lyrics. But he never talk about the truth at all, man. Cause I even heard he was trying to um, Jay Z wanted to sign him, man. Cause hold up, and he's supposed to be number one. So if he's um the best Christian rappers out there, so you are gonna have the better the um, the baddest one in the hip hop industry trying to sign you. So if you if you able so if you able to get the best Christian rappers, you be able to um to see a lot of um people, man, to get the damn chip, man. What about um what what what? If I could say something like it's not only Christian rap, like at like beginning of the year, they had the most wickedest nigga ever, Kanye West, oh. go to Trinity. A, a oh, super heard, church. Heard, heard. It was so packed, like I heard it was so packed, people had to get chairs to sit outside of the of the, of the building. And the outside building of the building? was a super church. A mega church so called, man. I can say something, like 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 you were saying earlier, I um about the Christian rap. I forgot what's the name, but you had put the video on the page. Um, Chris Lee. Chris Lee. Trip Lee. Lee. Lee, yeah. Dog, dog, dog talk about saying, saying hero, my hero. At the end of the video, you see dog getting a chip, bruh. Yeah, he they got show the mark you. on his arm. Because in that video, he's over there. He's, he's um he having a spiritual fight in the beginning. Now, he talking to a friend, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And then he had a concert to do, man. 
Now these damn Christian rappers, they ain't but false idols anyway. So he's on stage performing, doing his thing, and then they showed you that he took the um, he took the mark on his right hand. And then you see, and they put the camera back to the um, fans, and they got their hands up. In that moment, you see them, they worshiping this guy, man. He's a false idol. They got the mark too. And they had the mark, the same mark that he has, man. So they showing you about music, man. Through the power, through the power of music, because music is real powerful, man. At a certain degree, music able to control your emotions, man. Because when you break up with your girl, man, whatever, what the hell niggas like to do, man? <laughs>